everyone, it's Marlis from Student Family Housing. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to use some simple materials to make some beautiful, colorful butterflies. By taking a paper plate, cutting it in half, and then making a little groove down each side, I was able to connect the two plates with these clothing hanger pins. Now, I'll be able to paint these plates, or maybe use marker, to color them in and make any design I'd like. So after painting my butterfly, I decided to go with a cute little polka dot design, and you can hang this in your windowsill to add some color. So the first thing you want to do is you want to take a square piece of paper and fold it in half, like so. You then want to cut with scissors right down that folded line to create two rectangles. With your first half of the square, you want to take both edges, like so, and so, and fold them in, like this. Then you want to flip it over, and fold the bottom half towards the middle. You again want to take that side, and fold it again, flip it over, and fold it one last time. Could end up with something that looks like this. You then want to take your second piece of paper and fold it sort of like an accordion back and forth. So you fold it once, flip it around, fold it again, flip it around, and continue until you've reached the end of the paper. Then, you want to take this paper and bend it in half right down the middle and do the same with the second piece of paper. You don't want to place the larger piece inside the smaller one and hold it like this. Then take a pipe cleaner and wrap it around the butterfly and leave two longer pieces to stick out towards the top. Once you're finished, you can try and open up the paper a little bit to give the butterfly a little bit more length. and then you should end up with something that looks like this. You can then use a little bit of tape to secure this to your window. This butterfly is made using some clear plastic paper that is easily found at the Dollarama. It is often sold as material that is used to bound textbooks, so you can maybe look in the book section. I made a video earlier about this, about how to make leaf sun catchers um, using tissue paper and the same materials. I'll link this video down below. Try and get creative with all the tissue paper colors you use. The more colors you use, the better it will look on the window. Use a little bit of tape on the back of the butterfly to attach it to your window. When the sun shines through the tissue paper, it looks almost like stained glass. 